Hi, Francisco over at uh, Cascade Landscape. Uh, this is Steve, and I want to thank you for taking a few minutes to watch this video that I made for your business. Uh, I've done some research on you and also on your competition, and in this short video, I'm going to give you a few tips on how you can increase your online presence. And when you put these tips into action, you will definitely start beating out your competition online and significantly increase your customer base. So let's get started here. I got your website pulled up, and it looks like it's a uh, fairly old site looks like uh, when I do a domain age checker here and put your website in, looks like it's uh, almost 22 years old. So don't know if you've done some updating to it or not, but um, um, there's definitely some work that can be can be done with it. Um, the first thing that I want to show you is uh, here's a little tool that we have that shows you kind of the content of your website and the total number of words that you have on, on that page that I just clicked on is 227. And probably for your whole website, if we went through every page, um, you'd probably be three, four, 500 words. So the content could definitely be, uh, could be higher. Google loves to see over 1,500 to 2,000 words of written content to truly optimize your website. And the more content that your website has that includes specific keywords and phrases that your customers are using to search for you, your Google rank and your traffic will increase substantially. And I'll show you a little bit later on, on how you get the right keywords. Um, but the next area I want to look at here is what most people do when they're looking for your services. And... I just put in a typical Google search, landscaping St. Paul, and this is what pops up here. Uh, on the top, uh, there's some paid advertising, and then this next area that we get to is what's called the Google Map Pack. And how you rank in here is with what's called citations. And citations basically are just an online directory like Yelp or Yellow Pages, LinkedIn or Facebook, where your name, address, and your phone number um, are all listed. And so the more of those that you're in gets you into this top three, and that's a real powerful place that you can get to. And you can see number one is uh, Monson Lawn and Landscape. And if I go over here to a, a search engine, uh, you can see I pulled yours up here, and you have 20 citations, and they're number one, and they have 22. Now, there's a little bit more to it than just having, like, if you got to 23, you wouldn't just jump right ahead of them. Uh, it takes a few other things, but that's that's the main uh, thing that that uh, Google looks at when they're ranking that top three, Francisco. So uh, what I would recommend is just going out and getting a lot more, get you know, 40, 50 more uh, directories than uh, Monson has with uh, with theirs. And if you can get into this top three, that's that's real powerful. Uh, and that's not too difficult to do. We do we do that all the time with uh, creating citations. And then the last area that I want to talk to you about here, uh, real quick, Francisco, is uh, the next area of Google, and this is called uh, the organic ranking. And a lot of um, ads get in here like Angie, uh, Home Advisor, but when you get the actual uh, business, like this is the top business that's listed here in the organic ranking, and it's Blum Brothers Landscaping, and I got their website pulled up here, and to be honest with you, I'm not a big fan of their website. Uh, it's a little sloppy, and um, it's got a lot more content than yours does. If we go and look at their content, uh, they got 1,100 words just on that one page. So you can kind of see the difference just in having uh, more content. And then the last part I want to show you here is uh, here's your data on your website and your organic rankings. What goes into ranking uh, on this organic site, um, Francisco, is uh, a few things, but one of the main things is what's called backlinks. And backlinks are basically they're uh, one website that's linking to another website via a blue clickable hyperlink text. And the more of those that you're in, um, you you uh, basically you, you get to build trust with Google because they're seeing that other websites are vouching for you by having them on your website. So they're a little bit like a citation where you're on like a uh, Yelp or Home Advisor or something like that, and they're linking to you. 
but um, yeah, the more of these you have and the more good backlinks that you have, the higher you rank up in that organic ranking. And also too, and this is a, a, a important area I wanted to tell you about, is the keywords and the content that you have on your website is very important in getting into this top uh, page and high page of this organic ranking. And when you look at yours, you have 15 keywords uh, that are found on your website. Uh, your business name is being found, St. Paul Landscaping, a little bit. But this is the exciting part when I saw this and I wanted to reach out to you with this video is this is the amount of people, this volume is the amount of people that are using this phrase or keywords to search every month. So 300 people every month is searching for Cascade Landscaping or cascading landscape. Now these are also people that are probably your current customers or are already using you and they're going to your website to find something. So you, you, not too many people are gonna Google cascade landscaping not knowing uh, who they wanna work with. So you're getting all of your traffic, uh, 47 uh, visits and 15 visits per month based on those two. After that, uh, you're not getting any organic traffic at all from Google. And when you look at St. Paul landscaping, and that would be kind of like with what I typed in over here, landscaping St. Paul, uh, there's 200 people that do that every month. Uh, 200 people put in St. Paul landscaping. Another 100 put in landscaping St. Paul, Minnesota. Another 100 landscaping companies. You can see how if you add all these up, there's um, what, seven, seven, eight hundred people, uh, landscaping companies in Minnesota. And the other factor in this, Francisco, that's important is this KD is what's called keyword difficulty. And the lower this number is, the easier it is to get you to the top of that keyword. When you get into 18, 17, they take a little longer. We can definitely get there, but they just take a little longer. But zero, one, 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 zero, uh, zero. Um, there's there's a lot of volume out here with not a lot of keyword difficulty. And this is your position in Google Organic. So I won't take the time to do it, but if I went down this list, and went to these bottom pages, second, third, fourth, eighth, ninth, tenth pages. Uh, for example, landscaping, St. Paul, Minnesota, you're ranked 49th. So you're on the fifth page. And 90% of people who search on Google never go past the first page. And a lot of them don't even go too far down the first page. So you're not getting found for any of these keywords. So that's really important. And if I went over to this Blum Brothers and they are the top organic, you saw here that they're ranked uh, number two. I mean, they're really number one because Angie can, really doesn't count, but they're the first true business that shows up here. And here's what they are seeing. So they get some stuff for their brother's landscaping like you did for Cascade Landscaping. Uh, but when you get into Landscaping St. Paul, they're getting 19 people a month that are clicking on their website for that search. And they're fourth in that ranking. St. Paul Landscaping, they're fourth. St. Paul Landscaping, fourth. And you can see how high they are in their position in those key areas where they're getting hundreds of people that are searching for these uh, keywords. And and you can see they're getting, you know, 19, 19, 18, 9, 9. They're probably 75-ish or so people per month in these you know top seven or eight sites or uh, keywords um, that are going to their site and then even if they get say 10 percent of that that actually call to request a quote or inquire about some more information um, they're getting you know seven or eight calls per month just off of their organic ranking and um and and that's where we really want to help you and where i think this would be really easy to help to get you from kind of not getting anything to getting, you know, you know, more calls, you know, five more calls, seven, eight more calls a day. And and again, too, this is them being fourth and fifth. 
you know, look at the people who are probably third, second, and first. They're getting a lot more of these 200 uh, um, people that are calling in or, or searching for them. So, um, but that's basically kind of it. I know I kind of jumped around there a little bit, Francisco, but that that's kind of what I wanted to get to is there's a lot of things that we can do in helping you get organically ranked uh, to help you get into even the Google Map Pack here. Uh, that wouldn't wouldn't be a whole lot of work, um, but uh, it would just take a little time and uh, some effort on our part here. But uh, you can kind of see the value of that too. I don't know what your um, what your uh, profit margin is on your jobs, but, uh, you know, if you got an extra, you know, six, seven, ten calls a month and you can close even half of them or a third of them, you know, an extra four or five customers uh, a month just from your organic ranking is, is very, very doable. So, but this is what I do. And uh, if you do find yourself wanting some more traffic and some more customers, uh, feel free to reach out and we can talk about your goals and I can do some research and find out exactly what could be realistic for your business and uh, and what it might take to reach those goals. So uh, again, my name is Steve and I really appreciate you watching the video here, Francisco. I hope it helps and have a great day.